Hello and welcome back to Dark Souls 2. If you're truly loaded and you're the mad, I load the first assortment of spiffing and loaded two boxes of madman. Get the socket, this is 13 and all around here to guy. Now, there's something I noticed. This is the thing I noticed. Is the fact that these are orange. Does that mean they're upgradable? How do you even. It's supposed to have an, a menu of some sort. How do I open that again? But there we go, I double click it to open the menu. And yeah, that's upgradable. So basically. Yeah. Sure, why not? Let's sacrifice the other items of this type and see if I can use that to make some sort of an effective weapon out of these. Yeah. Sacrifice that, sacrifice the glaive. Alright, cool. Uh, accept. Oh, and I can choose an enchantment apparently. Um, frost or shock? Let's do shock. The shocking choice. I can still upgrade this further, right? Or would that... Mm, no, it only changes the level of the item itself, so it should be fine. Let's just feed every green item I have to the bugger. See what happens. Can I get another level out of this? No, uh... There we go. Okay. And now I can choose another point to it. Let's go with some resistance. That sounds nice. Why not? Uh, but that's where I leave that. So my axe is now even more powerful than before. Though I don't know if it was actually very powerful before, but you know, it's more now. So anyway, it's better. Yeah. I was wondering why they had orange borders. For some reason it didn't click with me until now that that just meant that they were possessed. Alright, this leave it over that side, which is probably what I require. And apparently can go through that passage. Apparently that's the boss that you need to go through. Oh. Don't need to fall in here though. That's not very useful at all. Uh, come on. Do you think that? Blink the eyes to almost every opponent we have. I keep hearing enemies but I don't see any. Hello? You just saw what I saw, right? Lots of rubble coming out of the gr air, even. It would have been fine if it had been the ground, but it wasn't. Can I jump from here to there? I'm about to try. Maybe if I was more skillful about... Oh, right! There is that option. Hello, page of the Book of the Dead. I need ten of them, then I can go and uh, open some sort of a door I saw earlier, but I was unable to open it due to the fact that I didn't have a way to open it. Makes perfect sense, right? I think it does. Bam! Come on! I want to do this too. Nice. Let's do that more often. That was nice. That was very nice. <clears throat> Open sesame. Give me the key. Thank you very much. Yeah, yeah, I know how keys work. Show me the first holy find. 
That seems to be my solution with everything in this game. Oh, I can't reach that. How interesting. But I want to get up there. How do I get up there if I can't get up there? What is this sorcery? Do I need to let the water... But I can't! This is the way that's supposed to let me do the water. I can't run up this sick. That won't work. That won't work. Then what will work? What you can find. You just can't tell me that much, but I know this much. I just don't know how to achieve this much. That didn't really work. And it wouldn't really work because I can't climb by that. Damn it, dust. Why aren't you more useful? This makes no sense to me. Alright, I'm just going to assume that I need to open the lock first and then do whatever requires to be done here. So get some water in here before I get up to there to let more water in here. Sure. Makes sense, I guess, maybe. I don't know. It's complicated. Yeah. This place looks nice. And not at all at Red Fort, but at French Fort. Got to remember that, actually. <laughs> What an amusing mistake to make, it's not entirely a factual mistake to make, so... Not many mistakes are factual in that matter, never mind. I love this size. Alright, I was promised loot. And the point of this exercise is... And seriously, I was shown a lot of stuff, but I didn't really pay enough attention to see what the problem was. Other than the fact that it's really difficult to push uh, the ball uphill. So I guess I'm going to have to use bombs for that purpose. I'm also going to need bombs for that purpose, and... I'm gonna need bombs for everything. So let's start by going up there and getting bombs for everything. Yeah. Go up. A bomb, toss it there. And bam. Then get another bomb and... Complain about the fact that I can't dodge while using a bomb. Sniffles. And I'm gonna toss it over there anyway. Should be about right. What do you mean you can't fly that high? That's not how we're meant to play. Oh, anyway. Come on, man. I got plans for you, your inability to follow said plans is irrelevant to me. Unless that is not actually a thing for this area. I'm gonna try the dust again anyway. That just got up there. Didn't help. 
Man, this path doesn't actually lead me up there, so it's fine, I guess. What path does? That has yet to be answered. Alright. As promised loot. So, give me the loot. Thank you. Most kind of you. Loot. I assume yellow items cannot be used to upgrade possessed items. Hopefully that will not become a serious issue. Hello chest. Give me your stuff. There's so many chests and so much stuff. I can't contain it all. Alright, let's see if I can actually... Oh, that's cool. I don't even need the tremor counter for that anymore. Just drop it there. Get myself an elevator. Or... Are you telling me? I think that's what they're telling me, yeah. Alright. Uh, this just got done more interesting. Where did you get this bomb? You left the actual bomb there, didn't you? Death. What is this sorcery that you're dealing with? Keep your eyes open for loot, Death. Because that's what we're here for. Loot, 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 and more loot. If you can't find any loot, you might be in the wrong section of the map. I'm gonna... Destroy this! I'm just gonna jump a lot now. Bang! 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 Apparently jumping a lot is impossible. So actually it's just to pick it up more health potions because um, Imagine that, I accidentally decided that it would be a wise idea to have armor and weapons that keep me at full health at all times. I did worry at all about the possibility that it may or may not be a bit more overpowered than I would have liked in the first place. You know. It's fun. Come over here. There we go. That's the corridor clear. Right. This is when they wanted to blow up. So I can do that now. Nice. So now we just pull the lever. Let in enough water that I can actually get to the, the bloody place I wanted to go before. I think I can follow the water to go where I need to go now. Splishy splashy. Me. I like the color of this one. It looks really, really swimmable. Yep. I wonder if I could have taken a shortcut from there. Maybe but probably not. But now we do have water here, so there is that. I can actually do the challenge I was previously having trouble with. It's not even a challenge this time. Yeah. Okay, um keep going. Up. Get that. And do the whole thing over again. Yay! Hey, the thing. Fuck yeah. Come to save another fucking episode here. Yeah. That's how the song goes. God damn it. Right, so now we have. 
What I can only assume is the path that uh, leads you back to the center. I think I saw it before. There's actually an option to go down here. Keep trying to go underwater with control because that's what worked in the previous one. Let's right click this time. Oh well. How did I not see you before, Crystal? At this rate, I may have to go back and do some loot hunting or something. Alright, now I need to go... Over there. Uh, close enough to shoot the bloody Crystal. That's my current intent. Can I shoot it from over here? I can. Great. Okay, I don't know if I'm supposed to go by the canal or to the door. Let's try the door. The end result is probably the same. Except the canal may or may not be close to human visitors. Or Nephilim visitors for that matter. Alright, are you a boss fight? You look like you might be a boss fight. See that big door and everything, and the whole setting and setup and... The fact that you look like a giant island. Yeah, you do look at the time Hello, Garkinus. Welcome to the show. Um, is this seriously how we need to fight this? Fuck off. I'm busy. Oh, are you dying? Good. Oh, it's the egg. Apparently I unlocked Reaper form. I'm not entirely sure how I did that, but you know, it's cool. I should have been doing that a closer, I guess. Oh, your jumping is going to be the end of me. Let's run this closer first and throw. Which is supposed to un reveal the soft underbelly to me. Can I just strike it while it's just chilling about them? Oh no, it usually hides its belly. Okay, that makes sense. Closer, get closer, get closer, get closer, get closer, and toss. And one hit kill, and back to the hunting. Maybe I should get something there which has a really high critical chance. Maybe let's have some possessed weapons for this purpose. Um. What is your deal now? I need to learn how to jump again. Oh, hello. I'm gonna grab your egg and I'm gonna throw it at you because that is how you kill a mother beast. Why are the use of its children? Mm. 
Yeah. Can I keep striking? Don't you not? Oh no, don't do that again. It's really cheap. I'm just gonna run around you so... You can't hurt me with it. Alright, he has some... Well, she has some pretty... Effective attacks, I guess, but um... I'm just gonna not worry about them. Because I've got some pretty effective attacks as well. Master Masher of Carcanus, according to legend, this hammer was recovered from the hold of a mighty sea dragon. This weapon was wielded in a savage battle in the fortress at the fortress of Carcanus, and with several thunderous blows from the hammer that finally broke down the gate. Named the Masher of Carcanus, this weapon strikes critical blows more often and unleashes devastating critical strikes upon the enemy. I'm, I I just you know want to look at that now. I keep forgetting to change the buttons to what I want them to be. But I'm gonna get that because I was hoping that that may assist me in a third, in some future goal. Oh, Masher of Carcanus. Increases strength but not damage. Ooh, that's a pretty decent critical chance I must say. Obligated. Why the contract? Again. Oh, I saw a blue item. I saw a blue item. I want this blue item. Get back here, blue item. What are you, blue quality boots? And some green quality gloves as well. More arcane and more resistance. Hmm, that sounds nifty. Can I use you for my axe? I can. Oh, and it, because it has resistance, it can assist in getting more resistance. Eventually, maybe. I don't know. That was my understanding on how, on, of how this works. Is there anything still here that... Oh yeah, this give a pretty decent boost. Can you push it over the edge now? Yeah, nice. And now I have the option of defense, arcane, or more resistance. Um, why is this a defensive weapon? Let's grab a little defense as well, because, you know, it might do s something helpful. I don't know. It's a nice little sappy weapon there. Yeah. All right, unleash the gates. The waters are going home now. Oh, nice. Anything inside waters? Doesn't really. Look like it. All right. So now, I'm either stuck here forever or I can live through this. That works. Uh, anyway, I'm going to thank you for watching and then I'll walk home. So. I'll see you next time. What's their problem? They die as soon as they touch water.